You know what? Me not going to hold up nobody time. I'm just going to jump straight into it. All right. Number one, baking soda into the water. I'm going to drink a cup of tea before I go to my bed. I'm going to put one key lime into the water. gonna put some parsley inside of it all right that's the parsley we like parsley just brought that from the supermarket ginger all right so we're gonna wash off these em emergency recipe this name See that parsley and lime with ginger emergency recipe. You see that? All right, let's put this one side. All right, people, this is a book. A lot of people forgot about the book. We still have the book. Lots of people asking the question, Chef Ricardo, oh, can I get a copy of your hardcover book? Yes, it is available upon Amazon. Go over to Amazon and get yourself a copy of the book. Some are too lazy, you know. When you just go to Amazon and go into the search section and buy the book. You understand? It doesn't take you nothing, guys. Just go over, click that button, and put in the details, and I eat that. Finish, done, and dusted. I support the progress. All right? Positive vibes. All right. Uh, let's, let's jump straight into the pot. Hot water. One cup of hot water. That's one cup. Don't feel no way when you see I put a little bit extra. Chef Ricardo done know the thing already. Alright. Let's wash off these ingredients. People, I want to put a time this evening. Uh, everybody got things I do. Even the fox them out the door got things I do. All right. So, so if you are waste time, me now waste the time. One, two, three slices of lime you can use lemon so please don't ask me can i use lemon chef ricardo because i don't like the taste of lime oh yes you can use lime all right or you can use lemon it doesn't matter which one because you have a lot of people you know they now watch the show now they come back <laughs> and then go back and say can i ask can i use lime they go repeat it again yes you can use lemon or lime all right now you see this? You got a lot of people don't like this. You hear them? Oh, I don't like the taste of parsley. It tastes herbal. I don't like the taste of it, you know? It's, it's, it. You need to start drinking it. Get them from the supermarket and buy them and start drinking it. Because you're wasting your money on the Chinese food and takeaway and junk food. Buy, buy, buy parsley. I make parsley tea. It's gonna help you with your with your sugar where you eat and put it in your body. It's gonna help you to reduce it. Let's be all oh, I don't like the taste of parsley. Well you, you don't like nothing. Time for you to just start drinking these things. Like it's gonna help you. You 
You understand? So, the parsley is something where it's a herb where natural and it's going to help you against a lot of things in your system. Detoxing out some of those bad oily food that you eat over the last few weeks ago. You understand? And I'll promote weight loss too. Alright, this one now. Alright. Now I'm going to pressure this one. I'm just going to slice it up and put it inside of it. Ginger. Lots of people. Oh, Chef Ricardo. Oh, man. You know, I like ginger, but sometimes it's a little bit too spicy. But too spicy. This is ginger. Ginger has been used before you're even born and come upon this earth. Before you even, your mom and your dad did meet each other. Ginger has been using. Get ginger and put it in a water and make tea with it. Good for your stomach and morning sickness and high blood pressure and all of them things there. Uh, Eros, good morning. All right. Yeah, get them and use them. Yeah, you know what? Uh, some, some big old man there, 50 at top, but talk like ladies. Oh, I don't like the taste of parsley. You don't like the taste of nothing. Parsley. Parsley is good. It's when I drink this. <laughs> this is powerful, man. You know what I mean? Umber, big up yourself. Thank you so much. Johnson G, what's going on, man? Yeah, big up yourself. Um, Bean is dirty. Long time, man. Merry Christmas. All right. A good vibes. Mel in the building. Right, what are you going to cook today now? And if I'm on... Mel, we used to have a manager named Mel in the back of the beers. <laughs> All right. I see that. A good vibes. I'm just joking. <laughs> Um, Gina, where is it? JR, big up yourself. Good day, chef. Big up yourself, man. Parsley and ginger are powerful sickness, man. Yeah, but it's sad. Only few people, few people know about the parsley. <laughs> few. Some people know not about parsley. Uh, is it this right here, sir? You drink this. Trust me. Any man met this be their wife or their girlfriend and she look at you and say oh my god I don't like that it tastes horrible let me tell you something go and buy some um we call it and um, friday take away your chips and make, and make sure you eat it all right yeah man let's go and buy her some fish fish and chips take away few people knows about this right here so few and is who are going to be watching now weight loss detoxing blood sugar toxin out of your gut you understand there are some people when they use the toilet it's really smelly and then the, and you call them pretty like diamond you know the piece of diamond they find in the place where much kilo you could have pretty like it and glistening when you use the toilet if you know and detox your body it will be smelling it will be smelling the, it will be smell of the whole house so that's why you have to take out toxin out of your gut sometime you're gonna have to clean your gut with natural stuff like these you see this this look, look at it come on is it this yeah a lot of Asian people eat these things and their salad and they cook it with it yeah, this is good for you. And then you start to go to the supermarket and you start to buy these things and you start to use it in your diet, you're going to see a changes in your diet and you're going to be more healthy. All right? So, if you, a person who eat like what today is Saturday, a lot of people like to do take away on weekend. You see, I like take away people who eat like the fast food, the mac food and the kf food they take away one that and they eat the chicken and the beef and all them things they spend that sitting at you <laughs> and you go to the toilet and you use it trust me 
it will be smelly. And that's why I'm saying these things are very good to, um, to detox in the body and to help you with your immune system at home. All right. So, yeah, man. Few people knows about this and an amazing recipe right here. Now, if you go on a vacation anywhere in Europe and you go and you see parsley on the buffet line in the dining room, I'm going to tell you this. Make a cup of tea from it. All right? It will help you. It will help you. This right here. All right? Uh, me, no, yum. Oh, <laughs> that one is deleted. Yeah, um, yeah, it's the meat lovers. A lot of people who eat meat, you know what I mean? Like, the, you see, me, when they eat too much of the meat and that sit down on your gut for a period of time, oh my gosh, in heaven, man. And you go and you use that, that you use the waste room. Remember, me tell you that it will be smelly because you're not taking care of your gut. You understand? Because if you're taking care of your gut, you, you do never be smelly, smelly. Some vegetable make your gut smell away. But when you're looking after yourself, it won't be smelly, smelly, and horrible where you're going to have to vacuum out the whole place with some sweet spray and all of these things. You don't need to. And I prove it myself. I don't eat meat over three, four years now. So if I use the toilet, it doesn't smell it, and I know because sometimes when I eat certain vegetables, it tells. Right? But this cup of tea is to give them to tell them, yeah, this is very, very powerful cup of tea, you guys something which can help you at home all right so get in the kitchen so next time you go to the supermarket and you see this thing named parsley or flat parsley just remember to put a pop in your basket all right um just as jade big up yourself hey jen happy new year man because they disappear i don't know where um they take you over the last few weeks um i love the herbs yeah man clean it and wash your heart definitely because people don't like to do these things at home and that's why you see so many people sicky sicky and every minute they end up at the hospital and they can't find what's the problem you know what i mean and it is just some simple little things you can do at home. You know, since even one of my audience was saying, Chef Ricardo, you don't have to seek to be um, taking natural herbs. You can um, drink a lot of natural teas and natural herbs and it will help you at home. So that's, that's what we are trying. Bless up yourself. Thank you so much. Hello, Chef. Big up yourself. I'm good vibes. We are trying to encourage the audience to do a little bit of natural stuff and to help them at home. Uh, some of you eat too much meat, man, too much chicken and beef, uh, ox, and especially the Jamaican them. The other, the other day when we do the survey, we said to we got to about 150 different houses in England. And this is what happened. The Jamaican houses. This is what happened. When you go to the house, we say, if you should cook a meal today, what would you cook? Hear them. Oh, I'm going to, I think I would cook some rice and peas and chicken and beef and ox steel today. We'll go to another house. What would you cook today as a Jamaican? Oh, you know, boy, you know, so tomorrow you know, we might have cook uh, some curry goat and white rice. Okay. Good vibes. We left and we got to another house. Jano star chef Ricardo boy a long time in I eat us some some stew beef uh, and rice and peas and I'm a feel for that me that cook today now. We go to another house. 
You ask them why would I cook today? Jano Chef Ricardo boy, I'm a fee for some fried chicken, you know. Jesus in heaven, man. Jamaican people. On the left hand, Jamaican are coming with the same habit. Cut out the fried chicken, cut out the ox tail, you buy a restaurant, you buy and you cook it. Especially women, them, they cook it with their husband every day. And that's why the man is so weak. They end up having to go to the pharmacy and buy so many blue pills. You get what I mean? Because that's why the pharmacy is full up of so much blue pill. Because every day when you're cooking the same food at home. Rice and peas and chicken and oxtail and curry goat. And the man then get weak. They don't have no energy. And then they go to the pharmacy and get Viagra. And you find it in their you know, pocket in the wash machine and they start to cuss the man. It's your fault. Don't blame the man. You get what I mean? Do not blame the man. Do not blame the man. It is the wife's fault. Because every time the husband comes from work, yama banana, and you cook yama banana, stew chicken, and curry goat, and ox steel, three different kind of meat. Big old pot of dumpling, as in done eating, gone sleep, cause I'm tired. You know that to be a sugar, so that's why we have to give you this kind of tea. You know what I mean? We have to make something like this. So, ladies, it's a wake up call for owner. Stop cook rice and peas and chicken tomorrow and Sunday. Farm, try and formalize something different. We don't want you about no ackee and saltfish. Yeah, that's a Jamaican dish. Try and, 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 and creative at home and give and give your husband something that when he done eat he can't go outside and start land more the yard you get what i mean the good vibes um for the first somebody's asking me what is it this is just parsley with ginger and lime for the blood sugar heavy food when i eat it you know what i mean so ladies as from tonight any man I eat them kind of food, eh? nobody talk about oh, my work very hard. They have to treat my. I think I treat everybody that. <sighs> if you're gonna talk about I work very hard, I have to treat myself with what? Rice? <laughs> Curry goat? Which man on this hurt is going to say, I work very hard, so you know what? I'm going to have to treat myself with some oxtail and curry goat and. As you don't sleep and you eat it, as you don't eat, you fall asleep. It's like you drink sugar and water. You fell asleep, you're tired because it's bay sugar into that. You want to treat yourself? I'm going to tell you how you treat yourself. Follow my program, Chef Ricardo Cooking. I'm not going to hint as that. But the message I want to say to all of the ladies, them, and some of the men, them who are lazy and can't treat them wife the right and proper way with a nice, lovely meal, because some of them are lazy. It's sleep too much or sit down in front of the TV and the weekend you know <laughs> the meat <laughs> so, definitely you know some of them some of the man them too they sit down in front of the TV on the weekend and spread out like a ship out of sea now I'm gonna tell you this yeah you work from Monday to Friday and you work very hard to pay the bills and when you come home you just want you need to get yourself into this groove and let the energy into your body, getting your body prepared for Monday morning and prepare yourself. That means your family can be having energy and you having energy in your system also. So rise straight through the week. You've been doing takeaway at, you know, Greg. Yeah. Eating, um, <laughs> they got the sugar stuff and drinking hot chocolate and uh, 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 fizzy juice. So when you come weekend, all of that stuff up inside of you. And then you come weekend, you feel tired because of beer sugar in your body. So your body is DJ, D, D, is drained out. There's no substance in your system. And not only that night, probably you might uh, um, drink and you're smoking. So that even make it worse. You get what I mean? You know, fizzy juice. 
you drink all the fizzy juice and you stop all upon the way and you're coming home and you say you call your wife can i get you something for come when i come you stop at the fast food shop and get some chicken or a burger and chips and you go home and you eat that as you eat you spread out into the house fell asleep no that is straight red flag that is happening a lot right now in 2024 so some people might not even want to watch my program because they say I'm talking rubbish. But it's facts. You know what I mean? We live in England. We see what's going on. We talk to a lot of people. And we know exactly what's going on. You understand? So, but number one, just to clear up this. And we're going to clear it up with the four because the month going to end very quickly. Ladies, do not make September month come and you're still cooking the same Jamaican food. All right, rice and peas with oxtail and curry goat and fried chicken and beef and fried fish. Every day we have fried fish. All right, so ladies, change up on our ways. It is winter season coming out. How are you going to cook a healthy dinner for your husband in the winter season that he can have been healthy to go to work and you will be healthy? Because if you are eat fried chicken the husband i eat fried chicken so it won't sick i understand so you're gonna have to think out of your box and say all right it is winter season rice straight through summer we've been doing a lot of burger and bun of chicken and bun of chicken pan the grill so let's do something different into the winter season you know so what you're going to prepare for your husband in the winter season, that means when he drives to work, he only can think and say, you know, at least my girlfriend or my wife gave me a beautiful meal yesterday evening and I feel different today. Go over to my YouTube channel, leave your comments and let me know, Chef Ricardo Cooking, because enough, enough people need to educate themselves on certain little topic that they can understand what is the whole situation in 2024 right now so go over to my youtube channel and follow chef ricardo cooking and learn more educating yourself upon good stuff at home people let's pour this cup of tea all right so this cup of tea doesn't request to have no sugar no honey no salt no all-purpose season because Jamaican people put all-purpose season at everything. Please do not put all-purpose season in this. All right, because I see it. All right, let's pour it out. All right, Jamaican people, stop use all-purpose season. Okay, anybody use all-purpose season for the rest of the year, red flag. All right. Anyway, I got Ring of Vision season with me. Let me see what upon it. My Ring of Vision season is natural season. It's an all-purpose, but it's used um, being natural stuff in it. Squeeze lime juice. All right. You can use lemon. Remember the word lemon. Now, do not use honey. Do not use Jen, yes, please don't use any chicken seasoning in it. Because right now we recognize that everything people have put chicken season, all purpose season, black, everything in a little knock. It's crazy right now. So please, this doesn't request none of that. It is something where you want to drink to help you with your immune system at home. A good vibes. People. <laughs> 